people are good on the song by Tepeche Mode that I have for you today. Now, when it comes to a bit about the track, people are good. It's the ninth track and the seventh single from Memento Mori. The song's melody is an interpolation of Kraftwerk's 1977 track Showroom Dummies, everybody. And the meaning, well, the lyrics looking at them, it's delving into a reoccurring theme in the band's music, which is the complex nature of humanity. That's what they're about. They go, they're multi-layered, this band, and when they sing, it's multi-layered, as you're going to witness in the video. The song explores the belief that despite the flaws and mistakes people make, there is inheritance goodness in everybody. And by repeatedly telling oneself and others that people are good, the lyrics are suggesting a search for hope and a refusal to give up on the potential for compassion and understanding.
Well, that was a deep layer song, if it ever was a song on my channel. When it comes to the lyrics, let's go straight up, because it's all live, everybody. First one says, keep telling myself that people are good. Whisper it under my breath. So I don't forget, keep fooling myself that they do all they can. And sometimes they sim simply slip up. But it's not what they meant. Heaven help me, heaven help me. Heaven help us, heaven help us. The opening verses set the tone, I think, for this whole song. As I feel what, what the group is trying to say is to admit to constantly reminding oneself and if I'm a bit nasally today, it's because I actually have a cold when I'm doing this. Imagine a cold summer or spring summer, whatever it's called. So do forgive me in advance. So reminding oneself that people are inherently good. This repetition emphasizes that perpetual struggle between acknowledging the mistake individuals make and for me understanding the motiv motivations behind their actions. The lyrics also suggest that when people slip up, it's not necessarily an intentional act of harm, but rather a result of human fallibility. Because if we look at the lyrics, when it says, they do all they can, sometimes they slip up, but it's not what, that, what you know was meant. How many times have we all slipped up on an action or a word or a saying, or a follow through, or we forgot something that we should have done, or we're in company and somebody said, don't mention this, don't don't refer to that. And you have, innocently. And it's nothing to do with the drink, it's human nature. And when we do, and then a situation is born out of that, it's not done with intent. It's done, it, it, it occurred. And instead of blowing it out of proportion, I always say, Let's keep things in perspective. But that's harder said than done, depending on what the action is, what was said, what should have been kept quiet, what was brought to light, that kind of thing. But heaven help us all if none of us can forgive the other person for making a genuine mistake. That's all I can say. Verse 2 says, keeps reminding myself that people are good. And when they do bad things, they're just hurting inside. Oh, this flu is really getting to me today. They're just hurting inside. Keep feeling myself that everyone cares and they're all full of love. It's just their patience gets tired. That is so true. I find today, I have to say, I have grew up over the decades, everybody. You know, I'm in my early 50s and I've got to say, I've grown, I've grown up with social media. I've grown up without social media. I've grew, I grew up through the 80s, the 70s, and uh, the 90s. And all I can say is, I have seen people's patience level diminish and there's a demise in people when it comes to having patience. It's almost like a skill that's forgotten. And I always say, God help us all. So it's very similar to this, heaven help me, heaven help me, heaven help us, heaven help us, let's say in the chorus. Because, you know, when people are hurting inside, when they do bad things we've seen it in the video it's not it's not intentional society makes us break out frustration at maybe not getting that you know person in your life that you've been chasing forever and they've given their affection to somebody else or you didn't get that job or you're frustrated with the area you're living in you see a social economic decline you want to get out of it but there's no way you've no job you're stuck for money all of that so you know, and you're hurting inside for multiple reasons today. And it says here, keep feeling myself that everyone cares. Nobody does care. That's the truth of it. The amount of people that have not got the patience like they used to, this is the point I'm making, where I used to go with friends, sit down, we'd all discuss problems years and years ago, just over a coffee or visit round at their apartment or home uh, or a mutual place. Of, of you know liking and we discuss things and we get through it and we'd help each other with our experience and our advices but today it's different it's almost like they send it in a text and that's you know sorry to hear this yeah terrible i heard about what happened in my thoughts and that's the end of it <laughs> and it's almost like 
When people are hurting inside, what do they do then? It's a built up, it's a build up of anger and frustration. And so they head out of society. And that's what a lot of people are doing. Because the chorus is pleading with the repetition to heaven to help me and heaven to help us. And that expresses a desire for divine, divine almost divine in, in intervention or guidance. It reflects, you know, the vulnerability and need for reassurance and the belief that people are fundamentally good. Through the word, sorry about this, though the word may seem turbulent and uncertain, everyone seeks solace and hope in a greater power in prayer or faith or karma, whatever term you want to put in it, asking for assistance in maintaining their faith in humanity. And it's very easy to, when you feel you're on your own, you're so isolated, to feel that there's no humanity left. People are just not sharing. It's like, as I said, send in a text now. And that's it, a few words. There's no follow through. The song progresses and the lyrics shift from that personal reflection to addressing a broader audience, I feel, by encouraging others to whisper the belief that people are good. So it's almost like a chant in the song, people are good, people are good, the lyric, the title, everything. Invite listeners to join in a struggle and maintain a positive outlook. The repetition of, in other words, what we see in TV, what we read, what we hear about, that the within an hour or the following day or the, or the following week you hear something good it's replaced with something good to give you back that faith that not all is bad because if you were to honestly sit down and just listen to the news you'd swear the world was going to end tomorrow with all those propagandists and all those um uh, what, what's the, what's the term on them people who create uh situations but anyway the repetition of feeling yourself recognizes those challenges of maintaining that belief, but simultaneously serves as a call to preserve against the odds. Now, the bridge here says everything will be all right in time, it will be fine. That just offers optimism amidst those struggles, reinforces the idea that despite difficulties facing upholding the belief in people's goodness, there is a sense of inherent trust in eventual resolution of challenges or faces in life. And it suggests with patience and time, and this is what people don't have, and I mentioned before, that the goodness within individuals will prevail, enabling a better future. In other words, what we see in situations war, there'll be peace. What we see in lack of food, there'll be more and plentiful again. And what we see with the demise of economies and close down of shops and situations, there'll be people protesting to get things back to the way they were. There's too much world control at the moment hidden agendas with politicians and we are kept in the dark we see our money being taken away from us and what we need to do is rise above it and prevail uh, for a better future now the final re refrain in this serves as a reiteration of the song's central theme which is because people are good whisper it under your breath people are good keep fooling yourself it says people are good whisper it under your breath people are good keep fooling yourself People are good. In other words, that chant, people are good, just believe it. In other words, just take it on board under your breath. It, it conveys that sense of quiet determination to believe that in this world of darkness, there's always light. It underscores the notion that even in the face of adversity or skepticism that we might have, it's crucial in life, the mental over the physical, to maintain the faith that humanity possesses, that there is innate goodness even through this craziness we're all experiencing. Overall, people are good. Depeche Mode, congratulations. Exploit, explores all those complexities we've just talked about. A refusal to give up hope. Divine inspiration it's calling for. And the song invites you all to search for hope and remain true to yourself. Remain true to your faith. Remain true to your beliefs. And you will get through the dark times. That's what, that's what for me, it's all about. I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you for a great song, as always. Many layers. That's why it's taken a while to get through this. But I hope you've enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, like. And if you like more of this, subscribe. Take care.